It's the Gold Super Final of 2001. Three-year-old pacing fillies are off. A tentative beginning and taken back with Shaw Moore Lynn noticeably at the start there. Driving first to the top. Run around Jade with private session. Down the middle comes Northern Accord. Widest of all, Fern Bank Fiona firing into the top four. Silver seven lays just off the speed from fifth. Northern Cameo is sixth away. Moving seventh into the first turn for Southview Sabrina. Then Twinby Rosebud and Culis is ninth. And uh, Shaw Moore Lynn was in problems early and his gap from the field. The opening quarter battled in 20 seven and three a brief lead for northern accord she gives way to fernbank fiona run around jade is up on the move private session now back in fourth after three eighths of the mile two more lengths to silver seven yet to close the gap from fifth northern cameo is sixth in the back stretch lagging from seventh with southview sabrina twin b rosebud started up eighth on the outside culis is ninth the distance trailer shaw Lynn. on up to the half Fern Bank Fiona gave up that lead. She sits the pocket behind Runaround Jade in 56 seconds. Mike Saftig and Runaround Jade lead him on to the final turn. Fern Bank Fiona is second. Private session starting up first over to make the sacrifice. Silver seven seizing the moment. She's second over about three lengths off the leader. On the inside fifth is Northern Accord on that final turn. Northern Cameo sixth on the outside. Sticking in from seventh Southview Sabrina. Twin B Rosebud a long way to come from Eighth. Culis is ninth on the outside. Out of it early was Shamor Lynn, and it's run around Jade. Silver seven rolls wide. Fernbank Fiona out of the pocket. Run around Jade has built it up to a two length lead. Fernbank Fiona out of the pocket. Silver seven is trying hard out in the center of the track. 126 and three. Three quarter time. It's a sprint to the end. Fernbank Fiona is going to overcome post 10 to win the gold super final of 2001. Fernbank Fiona. 10 to 1 shocker in the gold super final over runaround Jade and Silver 7 in 155 and 4. Fernbank Fiona was back in Mohawk's winner circle. From capturing the gold super final, Camlock three-year-old brown filly from Ripe is Ready, co-owned and bred by John Fleischman of Stittsville, Ontario, co-owners, the other breeders, Bob Young and Daryl Monroe, trained by Sean Robinson, driven to victory by Tony Kerwood, Suman Tour, the groom of Fernbank Fiona, her eighth and 22 this year, and her bankroll grows by $125,000 with the Gold Super Final Championship. Joined by Tony Kerwood, who uh, picks up the win in race number eight with Fernbank Fiona, 55-4. and four. And Tony, uh, he had to overcome the 10-hole. Yeah, it was, had me worried at first, but she overcame it well, and things went good. Sat the uh, pocket behind, run around Jade, and as you turned for home, uh, you pulled the pocket. Did you feel strong or feel confident coming down the lane? Actually, she felt real good in the hole. I knew she wanted out, and I was just waiting for a little room, and when she went out, she did her thing. All right, and the folks at home are getting a look at, or uh, are getting a look at the uh, stretch drive on the uh, finish there. And uh, will we see this uh, this uh, filly back for the Canadian breeders? I believe that's where they're going with her. I'm, I haven't talked to anybody really, but I think that's where they're going. All right, that's uh, Tony Kerwood who picks up the win with Fernbank Fiona, Fiona in the uh, three-year-old filly pace. Congratulations, Tony. And we'll uh, set you back up. Uh, we still wait for prices from the eighth race, so... Uh, We'll go to the uh, tote board, and hopefully it'll be official momentarily. 3,700, uh, obviously several winners in that category. And Fernbank, Fiona, uh, I'm sure.